What is good, y'all? It's your boy, The Shows, and if you're new to the channel, welcome to Shows World TV. So today we're finally here, y'all. Attack on Titan, episode 21, season 4, from you 2,000 years ago. Now, of course, where we last left off with episode 20 for Memories of the Future, Zeke thought he had Aaron, you know, under the influence and could push him to do whatever he wanted, but it turns out it was the opposite, and Aaron had the reverse Uno card, you feel me? So... Right now, basically, Zeke is just shocked that Aaron had plotted all these things, including, which shocked a lot of people, including me when I had, you know, read this part in the manga before, you know, that Aaron had basically was the responsible <clears throat> English. Aaron was the reason, basically, that the whole, like, Rice family at the time, you know, except for the father, Rod Rice, was killed. You know, during that time when Grisha had discovered the basement. So, turns out that, obviously, future Aaron can influence things in the past. You know, because it was originally thought that if you go in the past, you can't really change or affect anything. But, of course, that was the wrong idea. Now, before we move on to this episode, right? Once again, as a disclaimer, and you can skip all of this. I'm going to put a timestamp for you all so that you don't have to go for all of this. Basically... I'm watching this as a fan, even though I read the manga past the storyline where, you know, the whole thing ends. So I don't want any spoilers in the comments, because if you do, you will be blocked. Once again, you've been warned. <laughs> All right, so without further ado, enough chit-chat. Let's get right into this. All right, this is episode 21 from you 2,000 years ago. We're literally starting off where we left off, and they're showing the fight between Grisha and uh, Freida. As the Fountain Titan. Yeah. This was brutal. It was said that Frida didn't have enough time to, you know, fight and train with this. So, that is why Grisha was able to take it so easily. As you can brutally see. Yikes. To this day, I still find this messed up. That he did all that to them kids, man. Aaron won't show you everything because what happens that day is pretty tragic. And unfortunately, what happened with Carla too. Which is just ironic because it was your ex-wife. Literally. You know, I think as far as animes go, this is definitely one of the top um, disturbing moments discovered in anime. That, um... The person you thought you raised turned out to be a completely different individual. Or even worse. Well, pretty much. Hmm. Yeah, when he touched, um, Krista's hand. Mm. I'm not so sure about that. It would seem that now we're getting a Mir's backstory. They conquered a village. Hmm.
Okay, that is just brutal for real. I was wondering how they were going to animate this, and it's just as I imagined a bland and dark time. Mm. She fell into the river. Man, that sucks. You can't go back because then the others might attack. Mmm. Wow, the first Fountain Titan. So this is the first Eldian Empire. Mm -mm. That is not a reward in the way you're thinking. It's just crazy to think that this was all accepted and she just felt like she had no choice but to do what she was told. It's like, even with all that power, you still felt like you had no choice. I guess the mind gets molded in different ways, you know? It just baffles me, I guess. I mean, it's clear that the first king only concerned himself with power and, you know... Passing down his, you know, bloodline. Ah, hey, she better than me. That's just crazy. I couldn't see myself sacrificing myself for someone like that, man. the three walls they just it's just bizarre to me that they had to eat their mother All of just this, all of this just to keep a power going. That's just crazy. And she was left in the coordinates for eternity. Madness, man. And they say time is both instant and current in this place. Which means she could have been wandering around aimlessly for years, just doing the king's bidding. I look like one of the first colossal titans.
Mm. He gave her a choice. Bro, the walls are coming down. These colossal titans, bro. The rumbling it has started. That infamous speech, here we go. Mm. Okay, so y'all, you see what's going on. So Zeke still tried to get a mayor to do the euthanization plan. It didn't exactly go his way. We got a little more backstory, obviously, with the fight between Frida and Grisha. And obviously, as you know, it didn't work out for Frida. And... Yeah, Zeke was still trying to keep Aaron under control, and it just it didn't help, you know. Aaron broke free from the chains. We got our backstory, finally, from the Fountain Titan, Amir, and how she was a slave, and she let a bunch of pigs go, and that allowed the first Eldia King to get her chased into the forest. And she found a spine-like creature in the river by accident and became the first Fountain Titan. But she still chose to obey the first king despite all that power that she had which was just insane to me from the beginning with the story when i figured it out and of course as you know once this was all told you know she was still about to go through with zeke's plan until aaron talked her down and said that you know he's gonna give her a choice and so he basically got granted her power and now he's the Fountain Titan activated. And of course that allowed 
all the walls come down by Shigashina. And, um, you know, now the rumbling's happening. You know, uh, it seems that Armin is still convinced that, you know, Eren is still an ally. Mika says she's not so sure. And Eren, of course, he brought every Eldian to the path to tell his speech about how he's going to trample the world with the rumbling and try to protect Eldia. Well, parody. Yeah. <laughs> with the Eldians. So, this has been a pretty intense episode. And I'm definitely looking forward to episode 22. If y'all enjoyed this reaction, please leave a like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you want to, please like it up and share it with your people. Because when you do, it does help the YouTube, the CD, you know, video, through the algorithm and everything else. But yo, I want to thank y'all for watching, all right? And for those of you who are subscribed, you know, over 200 subscribers. We're growing very slowly every day, but consistently, you know. I'm going to start uploading every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday from now on. I had a stomach bug about a few, you know, I'm going to say like three, four days ago. And now I'm better. So that's why you didn't get a video from me last Saturday. For those who want to know, I'm man. So, it's your boy, The Shows. This is Shows World TV. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter to be updated with everything that I've been doing. All the links for everything else is in the description down below. If you want more reactions like this, then click that playlist right there. And if you want one more recent video, then click that over there. Alright, so I'm going to edit this in a while. So, it's your boy, The Shows, and I will see you guys next time. I'm going to upload. Peace.